Hello there! Welcome to Diamond Exchange District of Israel with the noisy wind, with the traffic and all that bullshit. Today we're going to talk about how to do cold callings. Cold calling 101. This is a tool that I've used to basically build any business that I've started as well as my clients' businesses in many cases from zero. And I'm saying with no previous sales experience, without any marketing, with no costs, how to basically get to a point where in about a few weeks, like two, three weeks, you have four, five, six, seven, eight, ten meetings every every week with clients that want to meet you, that want to work with you, uh, people that are interested in your work and you're closing at least two of them a week on coaching, on your digital product, whatever it is that you're selling. So first of all, why do you cold call? Why would you even do cold calls? Well, the reason is simple. If you don't have a big budget to start doing Facebook ads, if you don't have the experience in selling the products that you're selling yet, you don't really know what's working. So you have to start in a way that gets you, first of all, in terms of mindset, that gets you out there, that gets you in a mindset of growth. And there is no more of a growth activity, in my opinion, than making cold calls, than calling somebody that you don't know them, they don't know you, and basically getting an appointment to sell them something. It could be your services or a product, it doesn't matter. Now, how do you actually go about doing the cold calls? Well, I would divide the cold call into three parts. So the first part is the pitch. How do you pitch something? What is a pitch? A pitch is a one sentence thing that you say to immediately grab somebody's attention when you call them. So for example, if I call a business owner that I want to work with, usually my pitch would be, hello there, this is Robbie. I'm calling you because I've seen that you have a business that sells X and Y. And the reason I'm calling is because I believe I can double your conversions online. Do you have a minute? So just anything that is like a big, big guarantee. The reason I'm calling you is because I believe I can massively improve the retention rate of your clients on your website. I'm calling because I believe I can double the views you get on your YouTube page. It doesn't matter. Just anything that is big, that's like audacious, that makes people stop and say, oh, this is interesting. Well, that's the pitch. Now that you pitch the person, you kind of tell them a bit about what you do. And then what you want to do is you want to qualify them. So that's the second part, qualify. You want to qualify and make sure that they are actually suitable to meet because some people uh, don't have the money or they're not interested or they've never worked with anyone before and they're not really interested, they just want the free value. So you want to make sure that they're qualified. And the way you do that is by asking a bunch of questions. For example, have you ever worked with a marketer before? Have you ever worked with a business coach before? How much money do you spend on average on your business? What are your goals for your business? Well, if I can help you get even half credit to Grant Cardone, if I can help you get even half of the results I'm promising right now, would that be enough for you to want to meet me and, sh and let me show you what I can offer you? Just ask these kind of questions to really gauge if that's the right person for you. Now, once you've actually qualified them and you say it's a good fit, you wanna to move to the next stage, which is closing the deal. So actually say, let's meet up. When are you available? Can you meet this week? Does that sound good? Don't ask like, are you interested in meeting? Or is that okay? Ask closing questions. Can you meet? When can you meet? Uh, are you available this week? How good does that sound? If I can do even half of what I said, would that be enough to get a meeting? Just get always get closing, always get moving forward. And now what's the point of this? What if this? What's actually like the goal behind this cold calling thing behind, you know, that, that very uh, scary thing that, that takes a lot of effort. What are we actually trying to accomplish here? Well, using effort, you can basically create a situation, as I said in the beginning, in about two weeks where you're booked with meetings and you can start closing clients immediately. Also, your mind shift, your mind just sh shifts and changes when you start doing cold calls. You just go to this, this inner place where you just feel comfortable just getting anybody to get a meeting with you and just think about growth all the time instead of thinking about breaking like oh this is not good this is uh, too much this is not the right message and you just get into this mindset of just out there just get out there and get shit done so again I highly recommend that you do cold calling it's an amazing activity both for a confidence perspective and from a business perspective and it personally made me tens of thousands of dollars through again just making 20 15 cold calls a day 
doesn't take too much time, just a couple of hours, which you're probably gonna spend anyway on stuff that doesn't make you money. So go out and start doing it. Now, one last point. How do you actually get leads to call? It's really simple. You just go to any online website, just search for the stuff you need. So if you work with business owners, it's really simple. You just search, for example, for coaches, web designers, uh, anything that you're selling, especially if it's B2B, and just make an Excel sheet. You can even have a free uh, plugins, extensions that you can use that basically automatically gather people's phone numbers and emails. So you just visit a website and actually captures the emails and phone numbers automatically. You want to use indexes. That's how you do it for B2B. Now how do you actually do it for like regular people, not people that are businesses and their phone number, their numbers are out there? Again, it's really, really simple. You just find a tangential way to get there. So for example, let's say that you're a realtor and you're trying to find people uh, that want to sell their house and you want to find exclusive deals. Exactly the same process. You just go to any website where people offer their apartments, you call these people up, cold call them and say, hey there, I'm a realtor, I believe I can sell your house for 20% more than you're currently offering. Uh, let me ask you a few qualifying questions. Are you this, are you this, are you this? Book an appointment, make it happen. Again, cold calling, single greatest tool you can use if you're currently broke and you need to quickly make a lot of money and quickly get into this expansion mindset where you're just thinking like growth all the time. It's an amazing tool. Use it, harness it, and let me know if you need help with it. I'd love to help you. I coach people all the time on cold calling as part of the immense list of things that I offer from landing pages to marketing advising, to helping people build a marketing funnel, a sales funnel, and more and more and more. So let me know if you need help. I'd love to help you. And also go to my website, robbyfrank.com and download my free uh, uh, 70 plus page guide where I teach people how to close $2,000 sales on a weekly basis. Thank you for watching. This is Tel Aviv. Love you guys. See you soon.